Hello, this is Drek, and this is South Park Stick of, the tr of Truth. <laughs> um, yeah, this is South Park, and it's a really awesome, fun game. I love the the elements of it. Uh, I'm just creating a character right now, and having to. F I really want to go derby, just because it's fun. Maybe this kind of hair. That's perfect, yeah. Good, that's a cool color. Um, let's see what clothes can we get. To. Yeah, uh, the stick of truth. It's it's a fun game. It's um, um, it's RPG type of Final, Final Fantasy. And it's just absolutely hilarious. I really, really enjoy this uh, game. Um, I've been playing a little bit, uh, quite far. And if you start exploring, you can, it's really, really hard not to explore or keep exploring um, uh, because you just get pulled into it like really a lot with the whole story and let's go black eye glasses no not really next complete yes so this is the first my first part of it um, I don't know if I'm going to do a playthrough but I'm definitely going to make some more content of it and showing a lot more of it and play it I guess it depends if people into stream interested in it and want to see it and stuff like that. So it's just well, I think that's everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on. Let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hon, you all dressed? Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but son, do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good. That's good. He doesn't remember. Nice parents. Uh, sweetie? <laughs> We want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right, get outside and play, son. Like, like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Yeah, we love you too. So, here we are. Um, of course, and... South Park universe, and it looks like South Park, and it, it actually plays really, really good. So of course we can loot stuff and explore the world. And of South Park, I meet the characters of it, and do really stupid fun stuff. Just loot it and stuff. Can can sell it. And if you want to, you can take a poop. There we go. And if you feel really disgusting, you can actually pick it up. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, that, that, that's South Park humor, humor for you. Um, it's really fun, but <laughs> also disgusting at the same time. Just picking up the one. There we go. And go outside before the bed gets annoyed. <coughs> so, yeah, it's a fantasy RPG game. Right now, so you can go around, lo 
food stuff, farm stuff. And you can dress your character how you want to. So I have a quest now and I can and I can see what it is and I can double click it so I can see it on the map. And the map of course is yeah, South Park and it's really big. I've been running around. Um and inventory, so you can see I have a health potion and a shit nugget. <laughs> and here's the junk. This is just, it can be sold for money uh, to get more money. And you can also equip stuff like this one. Or pigtail if we somehow want to be a chick. You can do this. And be a completely other. And this is that. So you can change your character as you want to. You shall die by my warhammer, Drowell! Nuh-uh! I banish thee to the forest realm! No way, I banish you first! Haha! <laughs> you can't hold out much longer! Help! Somebody! I can't hold out much longer! Help! Hey, no fair! That's cheating! I'm gonna tell my mom! Thanks, kid! I didn't realize he had a health potion! Look, my name is Butters the Merciful! I'm a paladin! I live right next door to you! We should be friends! Yeah, of course, Butters. So, we have a new friend, and it's like Facebook, you can see what they're, they're writing. Hey everybody, here's a new kid playing with us, and me and him are friends, that's the way nobody picks on him. Yeah, right. Now uh, that we're friends, you oh should yeah. speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Hey, where are you from? Where'd you live before moving here? You like Colorado? Yeah, you don't talk a lot in this game. <laughs> All hail the Grand Wizard! So, you are the new kid. Your coming was foretold by Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King. But the time for talk is not nigh. Let me show you my kingdom. Now, I've played a lot of this and I've been have a, have a lot of fun with this game. Uh, Oh, I haven't who's really played friend, that, Eric? that long. Shut up, Mom. Not now. I have had a lot of really fun times. Just got a beer. Let's put that on. There you go. For some reason, I'm a kid with a beer. Yeah. That makes sense. Hello? Don't talk to her. She's not part of the game. Nope. So, of course, if you're a fan of the, the game, the, the TV series, you'll. Welcome this, so. to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. <coughs> Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. <laughs> and here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kenny wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. So, a lot of this is just a tutorial. Um, but I'm going to do this in the first episode. You have been sought out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest, but first, please tell us thy name. Now this is typical, uh, um, what do I want to call myself, so... Douchebag? No, let's just go with Black. But, as usual, you'll see. You entered Douchebag, is that correct? Yeah. No. Are you sure you want to keep the name Douchebag? No. Very well, Douchebag. So, you will now yeah. choose a class. He Fighter, just, just mage, chose beast, my name for me. <laughs> of course. So we can go fighter. A mage is like mage. a wizard, only not as cool. A fighter has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. And you, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. Well, in my regular play through, I'm playing as a mage. So a fighter has courage, fighter. honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. Play the yes. We welcome to our kingdom, Douchebag the Fighter. 
Hooray! Now please, go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon and we shall teach you to fight. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for two dollars? No, let's just buy something. Uh, buy a weapon. Warrior's plate. Ah, a lovely you can purchase. Be buy and sell stuff, buy, sell your junk and get money because it's real, real money. <laughs> well, in game. And here we go. Weapon. Let's equip it. We have a weapon. We have some new clothes, fighter's armor, and they give like. Uh, the hands adds one armor, reducing enemy attacks. Perfect attack reduces shield by one. Uh, and of course, we have the junk. <coughs> Sorry. Ah, you have procured a weapon. Nice. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and, with the bravery of a noble knight, beat up that. <laughs> what? Kick Clyde's ass, new kid. What I do? <laughs> I'm the king, Clyde, and the king wishes to be amused. Go on, new kid, kick his ass. So this is the um, fight. I'm gonna kick your ass. System. Clyde, you have to wait your turn. That's lame. No, Clyde, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clyde. I know it's lame, Clyde, but that's how we're fucking doing it. Alright, douchebag, bash Clyde's face in. Don't be shy. So this is kind of a... It feels like a Final Fantasy kind of thing. So you kind of choose this. But it's a little more reactive because when I click on that... Come on, fight! I can do this. Ah. Oh hell yeah, Clyde so can I can actually attack. Alright, Clyde's attacks. wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. So secondary attack, core attack. Uh. Oh shit, dude, I think I see blood! Fucking nice, bruh. <laughs> exactly what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bow. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Douchebag, protect your bow. So we can block. Prepare yourself. Die. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Dude, you're already way better than Clyde. <laughs> All right, it's time to use your heroic powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> PP. <laughs> if you have a fucking better name for them, then fucking say it, Clyde. Fucking asshole. I'm the king, and I say it's PP. Douchebag, use your fighter ability to make Clyde pay for insulting the king. So we got some abilities. Assault and Mary. Clobber your foe with a baseball bat on a perfect to six steel additional attacks. Oh. oh my god. Way to wipe that smile off his stupid face, douchebag. Now do it one more time. Finish him! What? I was going easy. Take this! This does double damage. There you go. Ah! Oh, that was bad. Yeah. Didn't count. Don't turn the button right. So it will do it to like We can finish off with an easy attack. <laughs> Dude, that was awesome! You were all like, bam, and Clyde was all like, nah, nah. <laughs> okay, okay, you prove yourself worthy, douchebag. Now come inside the war tent and I shall let you see the relic. So there we go. Um, I guess I will end this episode here. Um, next time we'll go actually see the relic, um, the stick of truth, and play some more. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. I've been Drek, and have fun. <laughs>